Hello everyone, this is Cam and welcome to another BOTB VIP live stream. So I've got my friend Neil, Tobias and Romaldo with me today. How's it going guys? Hello. Hello. Guys good. good. Thank you so much. Happy for Sunday. <laughs> it was, I've, I've been sleeping all day, man. I didn't even realize if it was Sunday. <laughs> didn't go out or anything. Oh my God. Oh. Mm -hmm. So tired because obviously didn't sleep last night. So that's nice. the right. Yeah. All right. So whoever watching, uh, can you please give us some thumbs up, guys? If you like this video, that would be amazing. Ali just joined saying salam, Cam Salam. Hi Romaldo. Hope you're well. Brothers, let's try our best this week. Definitely. Definitely, bro. We need to win. We need to win this. This is our final <clears throat> final chance. We only got a few hours left. And it's a good one this week as well. We can win in headlight cars, basically. You can win uh, the car and cash uh, with it if, if your favorite car basically comes with the cash. So you can uh, play for that and some cash on top. Anderson just joined. How's it going, Anderson? Hope you're good. Uh, let me uh, actually share this uh, join link on VIP in case if anyone wants to uh, join us. It's your stream, guys. So obviously... Um, I'll post it there. Okay, so on the VIP page, as you can see, the comments that's the link uh, to join the stream. If anyone wants to join, uh, you can you know give your live uh, you know uh, thing. Then obviously uh, you can just join from there. All right, so let's do this. Let's share the screen and then we'll go from there. So we obviously got a few people here to help us today. So obviously, Neil, Tobias, and whoever, whoever uh, you know, else gonna join. Basically, we take your opinion and then try to come up with a good coordinate. So how many tickets did you play, Neil? Or did you play your ticket already, or you haven't played? I think it's a bit slow. I have played one. Okay, you just played your free ticket. Um, okay, so let's share the screen. One ticket, it was, I went, just a quick look, I was, I'm quite confident with it. Mm -hmm. But. Okay, so as you can see, obviously, uh, we're going to go for. So uh, I'm personally going to use my free, free ticket. Yep. Firstly, before I come on here. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. At least you can uh, submit your coordinate. Okay, right. So that's the page right there. What about you, Romaldo? How many are you playing few tickets? So how many tickets are you playing? You might yeah, I already played them. Yeah. Which card did you yeah. go for? Um five different ones oh okay are they all with cash or no, no no i don't like any of the ones in the cash with cash i see yeah i'm going for the s3 which has uh 40k uh on top and then obviously i'm also going for the 20k cash so the only one we... with the only one with cash that's there that i play for when it when it is there is the porsche you know because they sometimes do the porsche start the gts yeah 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 okay, amen with cash yeah, what about you, Tobias? How many tickets are you playing? Because <clears throat> you have been constantly, uh, you know, runner up from last yeah. few weeks. So, um, I, on, I only place a free ticket for Dreamcast this week, I will concentrate on uh, midweek. Okay, so um, uh, I, I think maybe, maybe I, I um, play two or uh, more tickets for Dreamcast, but not much. Okay, okay, makes sense. Yeah. Okay, right, good. All right, so uh, Midland J just joined. How's it going, Midland? Hope you're good. Say hi, Cam and gang. Hope you're all good. Yes, we're good, brother. Thank you so much for joining. Uh, Ali saying, good to play a few tickets. That's it. This is uh, obviously the cash uh, opportunities are quite good. Right, so Neil just shared something. Oh, is that another? Oh, okay. He probably joined from the phone or something now, is it? Which one should I keep? I don't understand. Because he got two of them. He's a doppelganger. <laughs> Look. <laughs> it's, it's multiplying. <laughs> no, I just refreshed it to kick me out. I'll go on oh, the phone and see if it's any better. 
Let's see. I'll come back. No problem. No problem. I think your internet is a bit slow. Internet connection or something. All right. So we're going to draw some lines and everything. Try to come up with a better coordinate. Obviously, there's not going to be many coordinates in the stream as it, as it's only the VIP live stream. And, and obviously, uh, normal uh, people who hasn't got the membership, they can still watch it. And uh, obviously, we get coordinates from the VIPs and uh, try to come up with a uh, it, with a better place because this is the stream that uh, we got to average already. So this is the stream where we adjust things like the coordinates and everything. So if we think we need to move it slightly more to the left, right, up, down, or whatever, that's what we're gonna do and uh, come up with the best coordinates possible. Okay. So Romaldo, have you got uh, the stream average coordinates? Uh, seven seven three. Uh, give me one second. <clears throat> okay, I can see. I got there. You go. Neil just joined again. Okay, right. So uh, the coordinates that I, you can see that's my coordinate. That's what I'm going for, which is uh, seven seven four six six three. That area. I went slightly higher up. I believe the guy uh, in on the right, he headed the ball already. So he's obviously traveling that way and it might be slightly higher up. So what's the average coordinate? 773. 773. 758. 773, 758. Oh, is that the one from yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's the average coordinate from yesterday. Uh, have you got the one from before? 787. Seven. Yep. 815. Okay, around that area. And uh, what's your best after like putting your coordinate? What's the best area? You don't have to share your exact coordinate if you don't want to. Uh, you can just, you know, Give that area that you went for. So starting with uh, Romaldo, what's your? Uh, I'm still not sure because I'm playing a couple more. Because I think I've got a better spot now. Actually, uh, okay. so if you go to the left guy, yeah, um, draw a line from his from his oh, eye. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to draw a line? Do you want to draw a line? Probably is better that way. Uh, well, no, because I haven't decided on the height yet. But if you draw okay. a line from the the left guy, okay, like, just go to the left guy. His left eye. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, no, not the right guy. He's the oh, person I'm undecided yeah. on yet. The left yeah. guy. So draw it all the way up to... Do you know the left-hand corner of that pillar? So left, right a bit. Yeah. Right. So that corner to that corner, yeah? Yeah. It. And then the same with the other eye to that corner. Okay. But then I don't know where to go for the height on the right guy, because the right guy is a bit confusing. In my yeah. opinion. No, put it onto that corner as well. No, not onto the corner. Okay, exactly. Just go to that corner. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, no problem. And then um, it'll be the middle of this line. So so around here? Yeah, yeah. And it'll be the middle of that line. But then I'm undecided on the right guy because I'm going to play like maybe one or two more, but I can't figure out where I want to go for the height from the right guy because he's a bit confusing at the moment. Okay. So, so now, anywhere on that line. Yeah. So for now, bit, what do you think? Do you go slightly higher up, lower? Um, I'm just looking at my screen a wee bit lower. I'm probably closer to the to the bottom cross that you have. Yeah. What about you, Romaldo? Uh, let me have a look at mine because I'll be able to see it bigger. It's a bit out. Uh, that's a lot. See, I can't tell if he's looking up or down because he sort of twisted his head left slightly yeah. towards the camera, which means it could be a bit lower, but. If he's headed it, like you said, it would be higher, so it's a bit... I, looking at his head, I think he is looking over his shoulder. Yeah. But slightly kind of, just above level, slightly up, that's that's my take on it. I mean, you could try the height of 701. I think that looks all right. 701? Yeah. So on the line. 701, yeah, on the line. Okay. On the line. 
Yeah. So with the orange. Okay, so around that area. Yeah. Okay. So let's go for it then. 701. Seven I still have to think about it a little bit more, but around okay, there. That's so that's your area. And uh, Neil, uh, what's the coordinate have you got? Like, I, well, I, I kind of put in my free ticket earlier on in the week and I haven't looked at it since, but I've looked at it again now and I've gone a slightly higher. So I'm around about my Y's around about seven to eight or no, eight to eight. Eight to eight. And what about yeah. the X? Uh, seven, three, nine. I just drew that quickly there now. Seven three nine or two seven nine. three nine seven three nine okay seven three nine eight two eight okay so that's Neil's coordinate. What about you, Tobias? Um, my my coordinate is um, eight one three eight one three. Eight five three. All right, so eight one three, eight five three. You went lower than eight five three. So basically, all the all the credit that you earned from all these weeks, you're gonna lose all of them now. <laughs> uh, joking. All right, eight one. What, what was it? What's the X again? Sorry. Eight one three. Eight one three. Yeah. Eight five three. Eight five three. Imagine if, if he's the winner this week. <laughs> okay. So, uh, he's, uh, he's got the lowest coordinate. Yeah. Might, might possibly be because if the goalpost is really, uh, really close to them, both of them, it might be lower mm -hmm. if he had the ball and the, and the goalpost is really close. Excuse no, I, I think, I think the, the red player is going for the ball. So. Maybe maybe the red one is, is going with, with the head, takes the ball with the head. I see. So Tobias thinks uh, the player in red, he's uh, basically going to head the ball, is it? Yeah. Um, but I, what I do you think he, happening he... in here then, Tobias? Hmm? What do you think happening in here? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I, I think um, I think it could be, it could be a, a ball from the corner, yeah? Yeah, and uh, it's it going to um, uh, near the near the goal, and mm -hmm. um, I think um, the um, player in in white and uh, red is uh, um, running in, to to the red player to to attack him. Yeah, and uh, I think I think um, uh, the red player is preparing to jump uh, to take uh, the ball with the head. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, all right, makes sense. Okay, so we've got some uh, averages, uh, got some coordinates on the stream. From the stream, let me just take some coordinates and we'll go from there. Okay, so Anderson, uh, uh, Anderson Ortega saying uh, 778863. Uh, 778863. Let's just take his coordinate and go from there on second. So he's got 778. 863. Okay, so he and Laura's ball. Uh, Ali, uh, obviously, Sean saying uh, 768814. I mean, sorry, 728. Eight one four. I don't know why I ever said seven six eight, but anyway, seven two eight, eight one four. Do you ever used to watch wrestling? Because he he reminds me like he's about to do like a swing switch in music, but with his left leg. <laughs> you know, Shawn Michaels. Yeah. The right guy. We like does the kick to like the chin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. No problem. So uh, these are the coordinates that we have uh, from the VIPs and the stream and everything. 
So, um, should have got my drink, man. Everyone's having their drinks. <laughs> okay, so this, the top one there, that's my coordinate, as you can see. This is, uh, the, this uh, orange one is the, uh, the stream average from yesterday. And then the bottom one is from uh, the before. And then we got Romaldo's coordinate right there. And then all the other coordinates. I haven't actually forgot whose coordinates what. But anyway, so this is the area. So if we start drawing some lines, what do you think? Shall we go to the center or to the edge of the coordinate for line? Yeah. Which one was my one? Your one? No, yours is this one that here. One. Yeah. yeah. Just under my one. Let's go for the middle then. Oh, I do like the middle one actually. I might keep my line I had for the left guy, but then might use that middle one's height. Okay, so from this side, I'll just keep it to the edge. All right, let's keep it to the edge in both coordinates anyway, uh, and then we can we got a slightly bigger area to adjust things. Romaldo, did you take this coordinates at all? Or? Uh, how many is there? I've got some of them. We've got eight coordinates here. I've got seven. I'm missing one of them. Which one did you miss? The last one? Um, or probably my one or something. You take my one? Um, oh, it's just Tobias's, I think. Okay, so Tobias's coordinate is... 813. Uh, eight five three. Eight one three eight five three. Okay, that's the bus code. No? Okay, so that's eight coordinates there. So, did you guys ever think that if the judges go a bit more to the right, you know, the where the supercar. We the, they put it on top of the top of T. Any any opinions on that? Like anyone going proper like straight up or something? Because they're no, just his, his, his eyes aren't going that way. On the other one, his eyes are actually going like that because of his head tilted. It, it's not on this picture. Okay, it's so, not the same. Yeah, it's it's not as simple as it looks. Yeah, because when you look at the both players. Like you can see, you probably take it that the ball's coming towards them. Yep. They're both looking at it. Um, the, the guy on the right, it looks like, yeah, he's looking at it from a distance and it's going to come straight into him at speed. But the guy on the left, it looks like it's just hovering above his head. Yeah. And he's going to try and jump up to, up to it. So when you put the two of them into perspective, it doesn't make sense. Um, is the guy in, on the right, the guy going to won the ball and. The guy on the left is just looking at it that he'll make an attempt, but he's not going to get near it. Because yeah. if you if you look at all the the, the water that's kind of dusted up around the guy on the right, like he's taking a big leap and he's throwing his arms up and they're kind of level down as you go to jump up. Yeah, yeah, that so, was someone sneezed on the picture. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, I was just a little blood anyway. Yeah. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I think I think the red player is going for it. The uh, cameraman uh, was looking at the actual game. He clicked it. He sneezed it, and the way those <laughs> two went in front of the lens was fine. Yeah, yeah, he wasn't looking for the viewfinder. He was just looking at the. Because there's a, there's a little bit on the left guy as well. Not much, but yeah, looking mm. off the left of his head. That's what I'm saying. It could be a sneeze. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea, Romaldo. A corona sneeze. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Nobody, nobody says bless you anymore. Everybody runs for a mile if they hear somebody sneeze. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or the, or it could be the guy he headed the ball already. That's why you can see all these plush waters like this. Well, that's that's a possibility too. Yeah. So if he headed the ball, the ball is going to be slightly higher up. I believe might, even, might be even on the top pole that goes across if he's headed it. By the way. By the way, if he headed the ball towards not like to go that angle rather than like just going down or something, just pulling it down, it would only hit that weight like 
you know down was that then well if the if the ball was coming from proper higher up and then he just heading it and lower it down in towards the goal post or whatever but if he did head the ball and if he if he wanted to go lower then he he his uh, head would be lower as well like he just if he just did it already and do you know what I mean the way it's coming well yeah, I, I uh, cam do you, I, I see- I think if if the the player on the right had um, winning the fight and uh, hitting the ball, I, I think the red player would acting other way. He, I think he he wouldn't wouldn't prepare to jump. Yeah, it's, it's, I don't know. Maybe maybe the, the, I I think the ball comes in the situations and don't left it. Yeah. Yeah, but when when we look at the sneeze pattern, we're just going to call it the sneeze pattern now. Mm-hmm. Would it remnants maybe that the ball has hit off him, and that's the kind of the the aftermath spread of the ball hitting his head? Mm. Yeah, because yeah. you wouldn't see that much of a uh, sweat come come off from your mm-hmm. face unless if you really hit something like you know. Otherwise, yeah. it's going to be maybe a tiny bit, but not that much. So mm-hmm. obviously these things are there for a reason, and yeah. judges will take that into consideration. Or it could be BOTB uh, guy, the who the guy the guy who edited the picture. He put some artificial mm-hmm. uh, one of these drops to make everyone confused. Could be, never yeah. know. Yeah, yeah, but but think think about the judges. Would the judges think about this? I, I don't know. I, I don't think so. There is I, a strong I, possibility I, to think about this. Yeah. And to taking that sort into consideration because there's so many, so much is there. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. much. So would, much of them is there. So would, the possible the, the possible scenario in this picture, it could be. Yeah. Both of them players were running towards Right, forget about their right, our right. Let's talk about our right and left, okay? So the both of the players was running towards the left from the right because the ball was coming either like from the front of them, as in like the guy in purple or pink or whatever that is, uh, you know, is coming towards him, like coming towards both of them. Mm-hmm. And somehow the guy in purple, he managed to head the ball first Yes. Now, as soon as he headed it, because the other guy was running with him too, he was kind of trying to reach out by somehow probably falling off or something. And he just basically literally looking where the ball is going to, like where is go- the ball is traveling to, which direction or wherever it's going. So that's the reason why he's looking like that. So he just headed the ball. He like, you know, uh, he just literally looking at the ball now and the way it's going. And because, as you can see, uh, with his facial expression as well, because he was 100% ready and everything to do something, to take yeah. action, to head the ball. Somehow, probably missed it. Like I said, they've been both running for the same direction. It's just a matter of a millisecond. The guy just headed the ball, and then the guy just, he missed it, and then he, he kind of uh, tried to look in here where the ball is going to. So... Putting them everything into consideration, body language, the scenario, the just imagination, how it's gonna be, uh, and and uh, you know about a real life situation and everything, uh, which obviously wouldn't make sense with judges, but just mm-hmm. saying for the argument's sake, like putting everything yeah. into consideration, uh, I think the boss sh- should be um, slightly higher up. I'm not saying it's gonna be where I put my co- cross or anything, but. I think the ball should be on top of the average coordinate within yeah. either the top of the average coordinate and this area right there. That's that's my opinion, obviously. I can be 100% wrong or 100% right. I don't know, but that's mm-hmm. my opinion. So if you have you guys got any explanation from... Well, uh, I, I think, think if, you, you, if you look at the player on, on in the red... He's exhaling, so he's either running and he stopped and he lets out like a puff. I don't think he's jumping because if he was jumping up, he would be taking a big deep breath in. And you can see the spittle kind of the coming out of so he's kind of like he's either come back down from a jump or he's just got to the spot. 
because if you're going to if you're going to jump up, you're going to take a big deep breath and go. And he's really kind of pushing out through his lips, so maybe looking into the wee bit too much. But I think he's either just got there or he's come down for a jump. But the guy in purple is definitely headed the ball. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I mean, must have a strong kind of whatever happened, as in like headed or whatever. Otherwise, he w you wouldn't see that much of a water around him anyway. No. So, uh, you know, it probably happened already. And uh, uh, that's that's the that's the result of it. Like, he just headed the ball. Now, it could be a camera angle. It could be uh, if you maybe, uh, maybe the guy in uh, red is literally straight opposite of him, not on the side, because probably the camera, uh, the picture was taken from a bit more this side. That's why it probably looks like uh, the guy in red is quite further ahead from him. It might just be he is right in front of him because the, 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 the angle the picture was taken. So if you take both things into consideration, I personally think this area looks quite good. What do you think about this, Romaldo? Yeah, I actually think about it. I think the guy in red is in front of the... Although the way it looks, the red guy yeah. is in front of the purple guy. That's why he's more clear, especially with his eyes. So he's behind him, and that's why he's turned his head to look this way. Yeah. If you know what I mean. Yeah. So I think the ball is passing possibly... It, it could be. I don't. I don't exactly know exactly. Okay, now, but... now, 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 now. Let me sh tell you something. Have a look at this guy's arm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just have a Im imaginary vision. Let's rotate the picture to the to the right a little bit. Is it right or left or whatever that is, basically. So this way, okay. So if you if you try to look at the picture from say he's standing in this angle. Where this guy will be, he will be in front of him, isn't it? If do you understand what I'm trying to say? I know what you're trying to say. Yeah. Yeah, with his hand, as you know, look how far is 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 reaching out. So obviously, if he got a bit of a different angle, the guy will be in front of him somehow. So what I'm trying to say is, them two guys are very very close to each other. I'm not yes. saying right opposite. Definitely, is a bit more to the left, but very very close to each other because he he was running either they both jumped by the way either they both jumped it's a bit of a physics you have to uh, uh think on it like either they both jumped for example he jumped the other guy jumped as well but somehow they probably you know uh, crashed with each other or whatever that guy headed the ball already and because he was running in a bit more, maybe he was behind behind him, and but he was running faster. So he's still kind of on the air. And this guy, obviously, because he missed it, he just landed and then still looking where the ball going. Yes. So if you know what I mean. So I'm giving all this explanation just to prove this point that the guy in purple had the ball already. Because if he was a public live stream out of, I would have probably seen a lot of arguments going on, not arguments, but opinions going on on the comment screen. Uh, but obviously, uh, it's it's a VIP stream, so obviously, uh, whoever the only the VIP members are uh, allowed to join the live stream. So what I'm trying to say, the point I'm trying to make, I don't know if I make sense. You can leave me, let me know, guys. Whoever's watching and not be able to, not a member and not be able to join the actual live stream, let me know in the actual comment below um, that. Do you agree with me? If you know what I mean. One second, sorry. Um, okay, let me see if I can. Let me see if I can do something. One second, because it's a tricky picture. Mm -hmm. Um, I am opening up the actual live stream. So, guys, whoever's watching, you can join the live stream now. Join the comment section now. You can join the comment section now. Let's see if you can join it. Okay, let me know. Mm. I'll probably um, see a few messages. Yeah, anymore. so the more you look at it, the more complicated it can get. Yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> to be honest, uh, Neil, what it is, 
judges, as I as we always say, the judges they don't really uh, spend much time on it. No. Okay. Even though they're crap, even though they don't know anything. Careful now. But, careful now. <laughs> but but I don't care, man. I don't care. But all I know, they are professionals in their actual mm. game, yeah. not on drawing lines. They are professional in the actual game. So there you go. All the comments are coming through now. Okay. Thanks for all of you for joining. Okay. Uh, so okay. guys, I let you guys in. Yes. Yes, guys. Um, I have to, to leave. I have uh, no right. battery in my phone. So. I really appreciate, brother, you joined. Yeah. That's amazing. Thank you so much. No problem. See okay. you. I'll see you on the next stream, man. Uh, cheers. Bye-bye. Okay. Right. So... I let you guys in. I want you, please, I want you guys, because we are here to help each other, right? So I want you guys to give your logical explanation down below of what actually happening in this picture, because it's very important to know if the guy in purple had the ball or not. If he didn't have the ball, it could be a different, completely different story. It could be really low, could be anything. It could be... Uh, uh, the guy in red, as Tobias said, he might be going for a head. Okay, right. So, um, okay, so reason I, what was what I was saying before that uh, you know because the the judges are professional in the actual football match, not by uh, drawing lines or anything. So they can tell sometimes by looking at some uh, situation like exactly in a second, like that's what happening. That's what happening. That's what happened. Especially I would say to say about uh, Andy, he's very good at it. If you watch his video where body language matters most than actually drawing lines, you know, the story of the thing, he basically, he can tell exactly in a second, boom, that's what happening. Matt also kind of, you know, you can say it straight away. Uh, so they, 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 this kind of thing, they actually, they are good at. So basically, they might just say straight away, oh, that's what happened. There you go. He just added the ball and this, this, that, that. And then they might be very crap at drawing lines and, you know, whatever. Okay, so I just want to let you know, guys, quickly, whoever's uh, uh, not been uh, or give it, give, given up playing BOTB, the judging has improved now. They got uh, about nine, ten judges on board now. So obviously, uh, what's he called? Uh, it's it's a lot better than before. So you guys wouldn't be disappointed. Hopefully. Okay. Right. Um, okay. Not a problem. All right then. Uh, so you just joined after a long time. How's it going, bro? Didn't see you for a long time. Saying ball is not going high. Ball is not uh, going high. As you can see, he could hit the ball with his front head or side head. So there is no way to be in a high position. What did he say? If he headed the ball, normally it's because the way he his uh, face, uh, especially the guy in purple's position, doesn't look like he... Okay, the facial expression doesn't actually say that he headed the ball, if you know what I mean. But if he did, the way he's positioned doesn't look like the ball going to go down. You know, sometimes we go do go down. We know, uh, not us, but the players, basically. When when it's a corner kick, for example, sometimes people jumps really high and trying to push it down through a corner of the goal, goal post. That's what normally happens. Sometimes they just pass it to each other. So there's a lot of options you have to uh, think of on this. But just because of this, all this, uh, uh, so it's all around him, that's what made, made me think that definitely it might be, you might just head at the ball because it's not going to be like this. You know, you know if you watch uh, those old, old Bruce Lee movies or those Chinese movies or even, uh, you know, the Hollywood movies, you know how they show that they're doing those action and everything and when you go a bit slow motion, just heat it something and then all the sweat comes out. You know, it's, com you know, so it's one of those. So in real life situation, you know how in the movie shows you just uh, punch somebody and all the sweat came up. 
So mm-hmm. it doesn't happen in real life such situation is th- that much. If you if you if you feel me, because I do a lot of slow motion practice. You guys know, actually don't know, as in I do it, uh, what to see the if, like what happens. You know the slow motion practice. Only this much uh, sweat will come out if he actually headed the ball. If he really went for it, otherwise it doesn't happen. Obviously they've been running probably for his probably probably the last minute situation is, is, is probably a 90 minute go or 80th minute go or whatever so they're proper sweating just head of the ball and that's what been happening now another thing for him to head the ball and get his head straight like this and concentrating or focused on the ball means the ball is not going to be very close so a bit higher up and bit bit far away from him even though the picture itself uh, they are quite zoomed in so the frame is basically really small just focused on them it's not a landscape a bigger picture so even though you go up to here for example if you, even though if you go really high and go here it's not actually that high if, if it makes sense uh, because uh, I do a lot of photography and I, I, I'm i quite good with cameras, especially still photographies, right? So when you zoom in, I don't know if any one of you are a professional photographer here. You guys would understand what I'm trying to say. I'm not professional, by the way, but I know. So because when you zo- really zoom in to certain things, especially the whole frame, like I would say 60% of the frame was covered by them two players. But you can see there, even though you can't see their full body, but because the picture, the frame is, uh, you know, too small. I mean, just covered a small area in a, you know, in a, throughout the whole frame. That means if, even if you put a dot right here, that's not actually that high. You know, if you see the spot price pictures, uh, when you can see like plenty of little players there on the uh, on the ground and everything, when you go slightly up, that means it's really a high because uh, you know that much high cons- compared to the size of the body of the of the players, that's a lot of high. If you know what I mean. So, for example, if that much of a high, you know this bit here on a on a picture like you can, if there is about ten players in the picture and you can see their whole body and see a bit of the ground as well. So that much of a height would be about five foot high, if you know what I mean. But in here, it's, 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 it's not much of a difference. I know I'm talking a bit too much, being too technical today, but, <laughs> you know, just trying to come up with match that that professional level of, you know, the how the judges can, in a second, they can just say or tell us what's happening by looking at the body language. I'm not in judge's side here, guys, but they're crap at drawing lines and all that, but just that thing I'm trying to say, because you can get it wrong. Reason I'm saying that, let me show you something. Let me let me show you why I'm, 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 I'm uh, talking for like last half an hour and trying to uh, find out what's actually happening. Let me just show you my uh, one picture, then you guys will understand. That's the reason why I completely misjudged it just because of the didn't notice and I just went the body language. Where is the um uh, that one? The super drive competition. Okay. This is the picture. Now now if you look at this, as you can see. I completely ignored that bit. I didn't even notice that. I didn't even, let me put a full rest picture. Romaldo just uh, showed me uh, straight away. Uh, did you notice this? The ball must have bounced back from the ground. Oh, now, the, dirt, the dirt kicking up. The, the dirt, yeah. And I completely, you know, when I was drawing my lines, I, I played from phone, my phone, and I didn't notice that at all. I didn't notice that because you only get three tickets. So if I if I have noticed that I would have played in probably this area because the ball because of the dirt obviously the ball is not there because it's 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 a matter of second thing uh, and oh my god come on what's happening in here I don't want to play my PS4 but anyway so if you look at the dirt that means there you go it's gone now. Okay, so if you look at the dot, that means obviously the ball has to be very close to the ground, just bounce back from the ground and it has to be very low. But I didn't notice that. Just If you just hide that with your hand for a second. 
So all you do is just, I went for this area here, so about here. I thought, okay, uh, that's where it, and it makes sense if you go with the eye lining. But after playing my tickets, then I found out that, oh my God, it's actually, uh, I didn't see that. And look at this. All of the judges, obviously, they have seen it and went for it. If I played on my iMac, because it's 27 inch, obviously, it's quite a big screen and I could have seen it easily, but I've done it for my phone while I was when I was really busy and said, Oh shit, I forgot to do the super drive. Let's just do it. I'm not gonna win anyway. It's only three three tickets. So imagine the chance of winning an extra nothing. There you go, boom, 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 three tickets done. But I didn't actually uh check, and this is that's the reason why that, that basically changed the whole thing. Just a little bit of a dirt there uh, changed the whole thing. So that's what happened. So that's what I'm saying. So if if the judges uh, if they say okay. I can see this, so that means the guy definitely, they, the whole thing will change. Whole outcome will change because as soon as they see that, oh, okay, I, I, uh, uh, as I can see, uh, okay, he added the ball already, so the ball must be traveling from there to this direction here or this direction here or this direction here, whatever direction there. So that will completely change the thing because a lot of other people that's like Tobias, they're thinking that guy probably going for the head. This is he's only coming, but obviously it doesn't make sense because he has to go for the head the way he's uh, um, in everything position. You wouldn't jump like that unless if he's confident to reach the ball because obviously it's a professional level of football, if you know what I mean. So that's it. But anyway, so many comments going on on the thing. Let me just quickly uh, check if anyone else got any other, other ideas that uh, what I'm talking about. Romaldo falling asleep already. Uh, I'm just having a look at the. I'm just having a look at the picture on my phone because I've not actually looked it on the phone just to yeah. see if it makes much of a difference yeah. on this one. So, uh, Neil, do you, do you understand what I'm trying to say? I mean, the point I'm trying to make. Oh, on your super drive picture, then yes. No, not super drive. I'm talking about this, like you know, all this. Obviously, because of this, is it might change the actual uh, result. Yeah, well, I'm quite confident in the spray that's around the player on the right it yeah. indicates that he's headed the ball. And looking at the guy on the left, he's puffing out. He's already come down from his jump. Imagine, listen. Yeah, yeah. Just before, two seconds before the judging. We went, done all of this. Two seconds before the judging, out of nowhere, BOTB, uh, that cameraman joins the live stream with the judges. Uh, I've got a confession to make. I have actually sneezed. <laughs> Before taking the picture. <laughs> oh, to be honest, looking at the phone one, right? Just looking at the phone, it doesn't actually. It's not as. It doesn't make that much of a difference now because of the one being high res on the on yeah. the computer. It's basically the same now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas before. It was a high res on the phone, and before the... it was a lot more different. So now, obviously, it's a high res picture on the thing. That's actually good. I mm. like. I like it. Okay, right, right. So, uh, Sai is saying yes. Uh, the guy in purple has headed. I guess. Okay, there you go. A lot of people, a lot of opinions uh, going on. Well, find uh, out and choose. I've been saying, Kai Cam, can you twist the picture opposite side and have the judges ever? consider it the sort of the player before um yeah they did i think they did uh that was one of the pictures i don't can't remember because obviously it's there, was, there was one where they mentioned about the grass coming off his head as well yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. the other day oh that was the one uh the t picture in it the t picture like the super um, picture. i can't remember there was there was I one way it talked about the grass oh, no no, no it, was that. it was like looking at that it? yeah yeah that one yeah, yeah, either midweek or whatever picture is just, just on that super dry, uh, super uh, uh, what's he called? Uh, 50k week uh, picture. So, either there's a second 50k week picture basically. So they were like, Oh, you can see grasses on his uh, face and this, that head, or whatever. That means he did this and did that. Do you know what I mean? So, that's what they do because all I don't want you to guys lose that money. So, I'm not saying, Oh. I gave you about one hour of lecture. Now this is the coordinate and go for it. No. Everything that I'm saying, just for you to keep it into consideration. Okay. Uh, Romaldo said this. Cam said this. I thought this. Said said this. Nail said this. Tobias said this. Keeping everything into consideration. I want you to come up with a good coordinate. Not just take my coordinate. Draw in, if you know what I mean. What if, what so, if the judges are like, yeah, because... 
They're like, oh, we've got even, so much even experience. The judges watching this. Okay, that's fine. It would make sense. That judges would be like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I would have, oh, Roger would be like, oh, shit. Lucky I wa uh, watched the stream because uh, obviously by the state of my eyes, I wouldn't have actually noticed that. Do you know what I mean? Now even Roger will notice this. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, it's, it's, it's better that way. Um, okay, what's next? Oh, what's next? dear, poor Roger. <laughs> oh, man. Now, Roger actually doing good, man. I'm, uh, you know, I shouldn't <laughs> be putting his leg anyway, but... Okay, right. I mean, what if the judges can tell them, they're like, yeah, we can tell that's definitely not sweat. It's obviously someone sneezes on the camera, we can tell. We've got that much experience. Yeah. Mm. It's a wet ball. Yeah. Maybe it's anyway, raining. So... Maybe it's raining. There's just water off the ball. <laughs> no, it's not raining. The sun's shining. So, but then again, it, it's usually League of Ireland League, so it wouldn't be surprising that it, the sun's shining that it's raining at the same time. It does happen. <laughs> okay. Now, now, okay. I've got another point to make. Look at this guy here. There's even one, two, three, four little dots there, right? Yeah. He, he's. That's him just yeah. coming down. He just spit now. He's probably going that, down. probably that, or, or the point I made. They both jumped. He headed the ball. Forget, forget about him heading the ball for a second. Okay, he missed it. He landed on the ground, and this little bit of sweat coming out from his uh, forehead or whatever. Now, he's he's on the air. He's jumping. He jumped. Why would that much of a sweat will come out from his face, if you know what I mean? So, obviously, it has to be. Well, what if he's just yeah. run in really, really, really fast and he just suddenly stopped? Run really, so... really fast and do this. Let's, let's check how many sweat. Get his proper, like, high-risk, um, slow-motion camera and get it. It's going to be at least 10%. Um, it's going to be only 10% of this. Of this way, not going to be that much unless you hit something. Like if you do even that, it's not going to come out like this. But if you do with your head, like, boom, that, then obviously it'll come out. If you know what I mean. If he's doing like one of those shampoo adverts, where like, like that. <laughs> <laughs> that's, what that's what I'm trying to say. It doesn't happen that much in real life. So it's it's not sweat. It's dandruff that's bounced off his head. Oh, uh, they got an old old camera out, and it's still got dust all over the lens. Right, if, like... if, they, if that camera can catch that much of a dendro, I want to know the name of that camera. Doesn't matter how much it is, I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> oh man, oh bro. <laughs> okay, uh, Dean saying, okay, I reckon the judges will put the put it higher as the player on the right is coming down from the jump of jump of heading it away, so it might be. Uh, between the green lines or just above them. Yeah, that's what I'm just saying. Yes, yeah, stream. Thank you for the support. Ooh. Ooh, this is the nut box, <laughs> so they'll go like off the pillar now. Yeah. Oh, they'll go the wrong pillar. Like, uh, remember, <laughs> like, Roger, we're like the window, it's, and then it was the it's other window. The lamp or breaks. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, right. So. Long story short, this is play the area. Where, play wherever you think because it's <laughs> play hard. Play wherever you're thinking. <laughs> okay, shall we just draw a center line? Seriously, yes. let's just do an average of this, please. More. Let's go. Ronaldo, have you got an average at all? Of what? Of these coordinates. Do you take them? Uh, okay, one second. I'll just do it now. Just remember to invoice them for this at the end of it, Ronaldo. We're doing all this work. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so it's seven six seven. Seven six seven. That was the same. That was the same X as one of the averages, I think, wasn't it? Okay, seven six seven. Seven eight seven. Yeah, yeah. It was the same height as. Uh, I think that was the. Yeah, it was the latest one, wasn't it? All right, let me see anyway. Seven six seven. Seven eight seven. Mm. 
Okay, so yeah, it's uh, it's literally between both averages, both stream averages, but slightly more to the right. Uh, I'm sorry, sorry, left. But like I said, guys, it's uh, it's something like I'll stick to my coordinate. Yeah, same here. Yeah, I stick to my coordinate. I'll go slightly more to the left. Uh, yes, and uh, me too. So, uh, you know, I will, uh, this is my coordinate here. This is Romaldo's coordinate there. And then this is the yesterday's average. This is today's average. This is uh, Wednesday's average. Uh, uh, so I think I'm going a bit lower towards yeah. the lower half. Yeah. But you never know, do you? Yeah. So, yeah, this area doesn't look too bad. So this is the area I'm going for. Okay. So today's average, let me just post it in here. Just in case, don't just copy that single coordinate and everyone play the same coordinate or something. Or oh, if it's the winning one, though, everyone like, yes. <laughs> Imagine BOTV would be like, oh my God. The amount of credit will have to go out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or, no, 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 not really. Well, um, yeah. I mean, the runner up, there's 20 runner ups. You know how people saying uh, about the credit, there's, everyone's going to be run up. There's only 20 runner up anyway. No matter where you go, no matter where they go for like be, uh, judges, it's always 20 runner ups anyway. And so, plus his car as well. Yeah. I mean, it's it's the, it's the set amount they give away regardless wherever they go. So it's, it doesn't make any difference. What happens but if anyway, like 25, what if 25 people only play one ticket and they're all exactly the close in the closest 20? How, how's that happen then? Did they have to play a spot the ball separate one to get runner up? No, 20 no they get nothing. They give nothing. Yeah. I'd be hateful that. Yeah. Average is X. Why I have a feeling Neil works for BOTV. He's a spy. <laughs> I don't know. I was thinking about that before. <laughs> what if Neil works for BOTV? <laughs> uh, joking, man. All right. What's the average? 767. Seven. 787. Why seven eight seven seven eight seven? He's gonna give all this coordinates to the judges tomorrow. <laughs> don't keep go away, there. keep away from it. No, they don't have to work. <laughs> they just it's it's a live public. It's one of those, <laughs> he gradually walks by them and drops the envelope on the floor as they walk by, and then they pick it up. It's like a secret dealing with yeah. Definitely. All right, so this is the area, guys. Uh, uh, thanks all of you for watching. Neil, Romaldo, really appreciate that you guys join and your opinion. It's a um, pleasure. You know, give it a go, guys. You never know. And one more thing, the people who are trying to give up play BOTB. We all love this uh, competition. Uh, like I always say, we got we are you know a bit emotionally attached with playing and you know be possessive to win and all kind of thing. So don't give up. Play one or two, two tickets. Give it a go. Judging has been improved. And I appreciate that BOTB did a good job uh, bringing 10 judges on board. So, you know, like I said, give it a go. I'm not saying go crazy and play a lot of tickets, but at least play a few tickets. But please don't give up. So thanks all of you for watching. And uh, we are doing a live stream tomorrow at 2 p.m. That's going to be the final video for the midweek competition. So make sure don't forget to join that. And one more thing, guys, for all of you who watch this Blah Blah show, uh, make sure uh, li uh, subscribe to my blogging channel because we are taking that Blah Blah show to Cam's blogging, uh, Cam's vlog channel. So I'll leave a link to the description below. Make sure uh, subscribe uh, to that channel to join and to watch the Blah Blah show. So thanks all of you for watching. I hope you guys win. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Till then, take care. Stay home. Stay safe. And see you on my next video. Bye-bye. All right.